himself and does his work on the filthy and corrupt man. To make an imperfect God becomes man. He shepherds and attends to them. To the great red dragon's heart To save and to conquer those corrupt Doing the task and changing And making them new He humbles himself to be man And endures the hardship he brings It's the supreme spirit's great He gives his 
stumble, turn your back Look to get something in return If you love, you'd sacrifice Accept hardship and be One with God in harmony
human flesh is judged, condemned, sneered at by the devils he is pursued. He is spurned by the religious world. No one can make up for his hurt. Mankind's ferocious resistance His slanders, hunting and false blames Cause God's flesh to face great danger Who can understand and ease his pain
calling and commission If you are one Who the wealthy Who though supported by your Still accepts Accepts his calling and commission Yeah If nothing can change Reject the call of God For your status And for your own goals All you do Will be cursed by God Yeah, all you do
wishes only for God's holiness and right. 
righteousness thrives through the universe, exalting among all mankind. Cities of heaven life, the kingdoms of
heart anxious and lonely God remained sadly He needed his plan to unfold quickly For his management plan to be done He needed to select and gain those who were correct For quickly bringing his will to effect This was God's eager desire and remains unchanged to this day Ever since he made man, God's yearned for a group Of faithful overcomers who know his disposition To walk with him, this wish has never changed It's always stayed the same, his hopes have stayed the same Regardless of how hard the road ahead How far off the objectives he yearns for are God has never given up Or changed what he expects His hopes for man stand well, Since this was said can you understand Part of his wish Your realization might not be Right now, but it will become something profound eventually in time. Ever since he made that, God's yearned for a group of faithful overcomers who know his disposition to walk with him. This wish has never changed. It's always stayed the same His hopes have stayed the same Will become a living fountain of life, 
God's enemies because of this flesh. Yet when He ends, concludes all His work, they'll stop being enemies. They'll be against Him no more. On the contrary, they will become His witnesses. All having been conquered by Him, become compatible. They're compatible with Him and inseparable from Him. Only the incarnate God can do this. Save man from His formerly corrupt depraved disposition we shall show the importance of his word so man may understand the import of his flesh to the very meaning of man's existence
This is the realm where God wields his power, the scope of his sovereignty and rule. The work done by God in the greatest of God's work. The work done by God incarnate, most profound of all God's work. Of the three stages of God's work, the most crucial are these two. These two stages of the work, the work of God incarnate.
He also concludes the age of belief when in vagueness God was perceived. The work of the last incarnate God brings man to a more practical age. The work he does brings all mankind to a more pleasant and realistic Instead of God's spirit.